let's talk about our dear friend Don Rickles. Yeah. Well, you know him for 58 you years. You know him for 58 years. I know him for 58 minutes. But I'll tell you this. When he first came on my uh, HBO show, where you could swear, and this, this is an he anomalous situation. Wait, well, you're telling me he swore. He I comes out. I've never heard him swear off the air. Never on stage. Well, you can probably find this on YouTube then, because okay, he comes you out. Tell me. He comes out, and uh, they say to me, "Do you want to meet Don backstage?" I'm, I'm like too nervous. He's uh, he's my guy, you know. And I go, uh, I don't know. It's like you when you used to say, oh, "I didn't read the book. I want to stay tabula rasa. I'm on the houseboat. Let me put a bet down." <laughs> you know, there's that sort of thing. So they said, "Do you want to meet uh, Wrinkles?" I said, "I'll meet him out there." So he comes out and he does the circuitous route around the Cape of Good Hope while we play the Matador music. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he came on. That thing made time. me laugh hard. Dun, da, 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 he used to wear an emperor's hat when he, he started in Miami. The Mad Emperor, they called him. Really? <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I was not privy to that, but he does, he does the long route. He finally sits down. I go, Don, what a thrill for me. Uh, how's, uh, how's things going? You know, I'm just kind of kind of rope a dope till I get it down that I'm sitting with Don Rickles and he goes, well, I'm on this piece of shit, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> I never heard him say that. Well, it's like I'm stuck. I fall play? out of the chair because <laughs> it's just like when you meet uh, a guy like that, you want him to lay into you. You know what I mean? Oh, you want to be able to say that Rickles oh, he uh, eviscerated you. Oh, he was unbelievable. Watch new episodes of Larry King Now Monday, Wednesday, and Friday on demand on Aura TV and Hulu.